Now, Cap TV First Alert Weather with Chief Meteorologist Kristen Walls. Happy Thursday, everybody. It's now 644. We're looking at a pretty chilly start out the door, even some areas of frost expected uh, early this morning. So make sure to grab that heavier coat. You're going to need it uh, if you are going to be out and about the next couple of hours. But starting to notice a little bit of some daylight out there right now from Richland's Columbia Point. Sunrise time is not until after 7 o'clock this morning. Today it's at 713 this morning. Again, starting off with temperatures in the 30s, but the sun is going to return. We'll have a nice warm up by later on this afternoon sunset later on today at 611. So let's get you over to some of those current temperatures and where we're sitting at right now. One of our coldest spots, Cleelum at 36, 38 over into Yakima, upper 30s as well for the Tri-Cities. 44 in Walla Walla and Hermiston. Good morning to you. You're at 37. Light wind speeds today, so we're not going to see an increase in our winds. So enjoying uh, some of the sunshine that we'll have around the area. Most folks right now between 3 to as much as 9 miles per hour. A little bit uh, breezy start in Ellensburg up to about 13 miles per hour. So few clouds drifting through. Other than that, we will have more sunshine back across the area for today. Pretty quiet around the Pacific Northwest. So the majority of Washington and Oregon enjoying a break from the active weather pattern that we have been sitting in. But here's Futurecast. Sunshine today, we will have more changes moving in for the upcoming weekend, and that will include uh, the day tomorrow. So we will have the clouds building in here for the second half of the day tomorrow, those winds starting to pick up. I think the majority of the area will be staying dry, and as a matter of fact, it's going to be a pretty uh, warm day. Those numbers in the low 70s. A beautiful day Saturday, but another change uh, sliding in here for Sunday. More clouds and just a slight chance for maybe a few rain showers popping up across the area. But overall, these temperatures actually start to drop. Typically, we're at 67 after that warm day Friday. We're going to be da back down to about 64 on Sunday. And then some upper 50s by early next week. So Tuesday and Wednesday, some of our coolest days uh, across the area. So let's get you to that forecast out there this afternoon. We're going to jump up to about 57 in Cleelum with 62 in Yakima, 64 in the Tri-Cities with 63 in Hanford, 62 for Hermiston, w uh, Dayton today at 56, and then Walla Walla and Pendleton near that 60 degree mark. So another chilly night is ahead with that mainly clear sky as those numbers fall through the upper 30s and low 40s. Look ahead to your seven day forecast. We'll have those clouds building in again tomorrow as winds pick up, but temperatures not too bad at 72. And then slowly but surely these numbers will start to drop. Kind of a chilly day on Sunday at 64 with more clouds, maybe a slight chance for a stray shower. Mainly dry next week, but more a few clouds maybe around the area. We'll have those temperatures in the upper 50s Tuesday and Wednesday, and then that seven day as well for Yakima. Another breezy day tomorrow at 70 degrees, and then those temperatures will start to drop. Beautiful day this Saturday at 65. More clouds and a stray shower on Sunday at 63, and then we're talking numbers in the upper 50s by early next week.